Hello, this is Guava Moment, and welcome to the final stage of Sylphide. You absolutely need photon torpedoes for this level, otherwise you cannot beat the final boss. I've done it once, you can do it with antimatter bombs, and I did it once with the graviton bomb, but uh, I'm pretty sure if you take shield, you're totally screwed. Photon torpedo makes it the easiest, though. Okay, we're doing a Death Star run, Return of the Jedi style. Oh, and we're not off to a good start. So, you gotta dodge all these flying batteries um, that you can't actually hit. I don't know. I think this is a really cool level. There's a lot. Oh. I was expecting it to come from the other side. There's a lot of really neat things in this level, like uh, the flying batteries, these mines, or whatever these are. And it feels more like flying inside of a space station than any of the other crazy levels that have come before. Um, this part of the level pretty much forces you to the bottom of the screen. And this, I have no idea what this is, but this looks awesome. I uh, missed it, but I crashed into the all-repair power-up. It didn't matter, because it it's an all-repair. It fixed all of my uh, shields. The whole picked up a whole crap ton of energy, too. I've got lots of photon torpedoes, and I may need them. I will have none of this guy's crap. He is going down as soon as I can. There we go. So this lull in the action is the time I should have been fighting that previous boss, but I just unloaded the crap ton of photon torpedoes into him. There it is, there's the core. Okay, final boss of Sylphide. My ship, giant laser. Mano a mano, let's go. Okay, well, I managed to dodge that blast. Uh, it's kind of tricky. Palms are a little sweaty here. Doing good. And we've done it! We've completed the game! The uh, enemy space station is in the process of blowing up. I'm fine, by the way. Okay, well, that was Sylphide for the Sega CD. I hope you enjoyed watching my, uh... Y y you, knew, you knew. You knew that wasn't it. Come, come on. Y you knew that wasn't the final boss.
So where was this thing hiding in the wreckage? Who knows? Let's go! So as I pick my controller back up, you might have noticed that there's there's no editing here, so uh, no changing of weapons. Whatever loadout you had at the stage 11, same loadout here. And you absolutely need photon torpedoes. Or antimatter bomb, but photon torpedoes much easier. So you can see our capital ships are trying to shoot this thing with their blue lasers, and it's uh, doing fuck all. But what can we do? We can unload every photon torpedo we have. This thing has a ton of health, and if you just sit here shooting it with your main gun, you will not kill it in time. Time will run out. It'll fire this huge laser beam that fills up the entire screen, and uh, it kills you, no matter what health you have. And god, this is fun. I wish Sophie had more boss fights like this. So uh, this is the reason we were kind of saving our option energy the entire game. You really, really gotta constantly wail on this guy. So as we fly off into the sunset, uh, that was Sylphid. It's my favorite game for the Sega CD. I, uh, I'm a big fan of shooters, but not so much of the bullet hell games, and it seems like all shooters nowadays are bullet hell. It's a good, fun, nostalgic game. So thanks for watching, everyone, and I'll uh, see you next time. Game out of it.